Hey guys, welcome back to another Swift tutorial, and in this tutorial I'm going to be explaining how to hide the bottom border on a navigation bar. So, a navigation bar has a border, uh, it's like a small grey border at the bottom, and sometimes your app might want your navigation bar to blend in with the screen. So, I'll show you guys how to solve this issue. Um, let me just call this hide nav bar border. And it's actually quite simple, but it's a bit of a hack as well, so I'll show you guys. Now first we're going to have to create our navigation bar, so I'm just going to embed in navigation controller, and then we'll make this green a, let's just make it a red color, and then if I just, actually well, maybe not red, that's a bit too bright, I'm going to make it teal, and I'm going to run it, and you'll s I'm just going to need to show you guys the border at the bottom, which you want to hide. So here's our navigation bar and let's say you can see that tiny border there is what separates it from the screen you might want to hide that so what we can do is we can go to our view controller and in the view did load actually whenever we're handling UI and things we should usually use the um, view did layout so we'll do view did layout and then super view did layout subviews and then in here what we can do is first get the navigation bar so let uh, navbar is equal to navigation controller dot navigation bar like so and now we also need to get the appearance so navbar appearance is equal to UI navigation uh, bar appearance like this and now we can actually change it so uh, navbar appearance dot shadow color and this is where we set it dot clear so we won't actually see it and then we just change the navbars to um, this so we do navbar navbar oh, not navbar appearance uh, navbar dot scroll edge appearance is equal to navbar appearance like so that's about it and now if I run it again that that border should be missing and uh, I don't, I can't tell, but I think it's missing. Uh, actually, I think it might not be. Okay, maybe this, maybe this version isn't working then. Uh, okay, let's just do it then. What we can do instead is, if I just let me try and move this to view to load, and if that doesn't work, I do have another way. So. Oh, uh, let me just cancel that, reload it. So if this doesn't work, I have another way which might work. Yeah, so that doesn't seem to be working. So what I can do is if I do self dot navigation controller dot navigation bar dot set value, and now what we can do is all we do is we just set this to. Oh, set this to true and for key hide shadow and this is a lot more of a hack and to be honest I'm not too sure if it will work but hopefully it does and yeah so you can see there's no more there's no more um, there's no more border and it just flows seamlessly into the screen so I'm assuming that you could just change this background color to whatever you wanted and then this navbar would just become part of your screen and you know that's just how it works. Let me just see if, there's, if I know how to change the background color. Background color, let's just try and change it to teal like that and let's see if it works. Ah, uh, no. Nah, so that doesn't work but uh, I'm sure you could just create a custom navigation bar and then you could just change it to what you like but you can see the border there is completely gone so this is the one line of code which you use so forget about the bit at the beginning I was just trying something else so see you guys in a future tutorial bye